Welcome to my unboxing of Samsung's A30 series solid state drive. This is the non-desktop upgrade pack, so we're going to find out what is inside the more value-oriented packaging that doesn't include the Norton, ouch, just stabbed myself, Norton Go software, or the uh, SATA cable and the power cable, or the uh, three and a half inch to two and a half inch adapter kit. Okay, so inside we find a Samsung manual, a digital Samsung manual, as well as an SSD. So this is more like an OEM drive that comes in a retail box. Now the Samsung 830 controller is unique in the, I mean if you've watched my unboxing of the 512 gig desktop version you probably know all of this, but Samsung is in a unique position where they actually build and design every aspect of their entire drive. Nobody else does this. Samsung is also number one in the world for SSDs and SSD components, which is very, very cool. They do a ton of OEM business besides just selling to individual end users. So odds are, if you've used an SSD at some point and you didn't know what it was, there's a very good chance it's a Samsung drive. Um, moving along, the 830 controller is also one of the fastest controllers in the market and does not rely on compression algorithms to achieve its speed. They use high speed flash, which they bin from their own fabs, and they make sure that they get the highest quality and the fastest speed stuff, then they use their own designed and own manufactured controller to build the drive and achieve the best possible performance. By cherry picking everything for themselves, they give themselves an advantage over anyone that is using any sort of a Samsung component that they buy from them in order to integrate into their own solution. So the drive is a slim drive, which means you can mount it in whatever you want, including uh, notebooks that don't accept the slightly thicker drives, and some of them, especially with the way notebook form factors are slimming down these days, don't. It also has all the standard mounting holes, so you got your two on the side, your two on the other more different side, and your four on the other more different bottom. You have a SATA power connector on the back, as well as a SATA 3, gig, uh, SATA 3 6 gigabit per second data connector here, and these drives are fully capable of using that 6 gigabit per second connection, by the way, as well as your Samsung branding on the top, as well as a beautiful brushed aluminum finish on on the top of the drive. So one thing that I wanted to point out is be careful when you're installing this. Don't get your grubby fingerprints all over it. Find somewhere awesome to put it inside your case where you're going to be able to like see it. Like just use, you know, Velcro to like mount it somewhere that it just looks awesome because it looks awesome. Uh, I mean, if you're going to have high performance stuff that's like all like chromed and brushed and stuff, you might as well look at it all day, right? So don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos. Thank you for checking out my video on the Samsung 830 series SSD that comes in the non-full upgrade pack, but just the, the OEM bare drive.